I'm scanning, but I'm not getting anything on my Hey, get out of my way, slug bug. Or we just make a beeline for it. Let's just make a beeline for it. We're only 12 minutes away. That's not too bad. Stop it. Okay, let's move something else back to the ship. Let's move a whole thing of Thamian back to the ship. <coughs> And oh, we actually need more platinum. Protection platinum. Okay, so the first time I want platinum and there's none in sight. All right, whatever's. Oh, we're gonna do this. Yeah, thanks for your help. Thanks for your help. We've, we've figured it out. We're gonna get back to that ship. Hello, plutonium. Get out of my way, tree. Okay. Alright, back to the ship. There's so many uh, attack plants on this planet. Not cool. Not cool attack plants. Scanner recharging. Platinum. Anywhere. Serious? Right now? There's a cave below me. There it is. Right? Yeah. Here we go. Okay. Alright. Level stabilized. I can't believe the, la the last gasp I ran out of platinum when I had so much. It's just frustrating. Go back in here, let's not freeze to death. Guess we can, uh... Really need to wait till that recharges, I guess. Okay, um, let's... Get some carbon and make another power gel. Two power gels. Okay. 
Alright. Okay, so we need platinum. We're gonna go look for platinum. We're gonna find platinum. Extreme night temperature detected. More zinc over here. I don't know if it's worth going for right now. Cause I need I need platinum. <laughs> like bad. asking if I know Dan TDM. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I know who that is. mine some iridium for a while. Plenty of it here. Whoa. It's just not very, uh, <laughs> not very thick, is it? <laughs> Hello, uh, welcome to the chat, Zataron. that mining beam. Technology recharge. Weapon charge deleted. We're really just waiting for our shielding to charge up because It's nighttime now, <laughs> and it's really cold. I guess I could make, I could hoof it to that cave. Zatteron, this game. You mean the game in general? The game of No Man's Sky? No Man's Sky is about exploration. Extreme night temperature and surviving, if you're in survival mode, it's all about just trying to survive. But mostly exploration. Um, there's no real goal. There's no real um, missions or anything. I mean, if you build a base, they'll send you on little quests, little fetch quests, but it's not really the point of the game, right? The point of the game is just to have fun, just to just to enjoy the world and and explore it. You know, see all the cool ships. There's, there's not really a story, no. I mean, there's, there's some story. There's sort of some story. Um, there's a couple of quest lines that do go somewhere. They don't end. Um, 
it, it's not it's not a story in the traditional sense, but there is there are small stories in the game that you can you know follow and enjoy. But there's not like a. I know what you're asking. There's not like a. It's not like Skyrim. There's not like a main story that you follow. A main quest that, you know. Kind of defines the entire game. No, there's nothing like that. It's kind of like. It's kind of like Minecraft in that sense, if you've ever played Minecraft. There's no real story in Minecraft either. I mean, although I guess they have a Minecraft story mode at this point, right? But the original game of Minecraft didn't have a story. Um, you were just supposed to explore the world and enjoy what was there. And Platinum, sweet, cool. We're gonna make it. Now that I see Platinum, we are going to make it. Yeah, it is kind of mine. It is kind of Minecraft in space. It's not, um... It's, it's different than Minecraft, too, though, because Minecraft... Um, it's in the title, right? What you do is in the title. You mine stuff and you craft it. This game is, is not really the same thing, because... The point is not... Um, the goal is not mining or crafting, although you do both of those things from time to time. The goal of the game Sorry, I just gotta get the shielding shards up. The goal of the game is to explore. Right? It's not um... In Minecraft, you, you don't really need to you don't need, really need to explore because everything that you need is pretty much around you. I mean, there's some exploration, but not much. But this game, they've intended intentionally built a a rich generation engine, um, so that every planet looks a little different, you know, and and there's different creatures on it, and everything behaves differently, and. Um, there's a lot more... I'm gonna go down here for a second. There's a lot more, um... I guess we're, we're stabilizing, so we don't need to do that. Minecraft travel? Uh, I guess. Not really. Like, it's maybe... Maybe... Travel craft. <laughs> It's not, it's more about, um, you know, it's more about just exploring and seeing, uh, seeing new worlds, right? And going into space and, you know, having adventures, essentially, right? But it, it's adventures that you, you create, that you come up with. Like this character, um, this character is going to be an asteroid miner. And that's what we're going to do as soon as we get our ship fixed. We're going to go into space and we're going to mine asteroids. And that's our that's our entire goal is to try to find, you know, cool stuff in asteroids. Uh, that's that's the goal that I've set for this character playthrough. And I'm also playing one life. So um, if I die, that's it. We start a new character. So um, it, it's been fun. I'm, I'm really enjoying the game, and especially with the new update, they they really added a lot to it and fixed some of the things that were, you know, not as interesting. Ooh, life support, power cells depleted. Okay, all the running I've been doing. See, ship is six minutes away. Okay. It seems stupid to do this at night. Um, because we're just going to use so much more... 
more zinc over there. Wow, I just must have missed all the zinc. <laughs> Dungeons and Dragons in space. Not quite. But there is that there is that sense like Dungeons and Dragons that you can kind of go anywhere and you can kind of just make it make things up as you go. Like I said, this character is an asteroid miner. She's her ship got damaged and she's um she had to crash land on this planet, but as soon as she gets it back up and running, um, she's going to get back into space and do, do some mining, make some money. Um, her eventual goal is to find a planet, a suitable planet to make a, a home base. Uh, because she grew up in space, so... I just need more iron. Okay, I need more iron, like right now. More iron over there. Can I run? Okay. Alright, let's just charge life support with... We don't have anything to charge life support? Okay. Why don't we have anything to charge life support? <laughs> I need carbon. No! Ugh. Okay. No, don't do that. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Maybe I can get some shelter under here. Okay, I gotta stop running. shard. Need more iron. This is bad. So hard to do. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Okay. Charge. Okay. All right. I need more platinum. Is there any platinum on that scan? No. Okay. <sighs> if it's not one thing, it's another. You're just constantly fighting to survive. Alright. Ah, come on. Plants. I didn't even have a chance to dodge that one. I just came around the corner, it was there. Shields back up. Is that platinum? Edge of cave. That's perfect. Okay. I think that's platinum right down there. Can 
Okay. Ooh, we made it. Oh. It's so easy to die in this game. Alright, need a little bit more carbon. Alright. More carbon. Where's carbon? A tree there I can shoot. Yeah. Cool. Oh. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I know. Thanks for the advice. I know I should leave this planet. It's terrible. We're gonna get there. We're really close to getting there. Oh, I'm missing. There we go. Okay. Still a little bit short on the carbon. Okay. All right, let's let's do this. So I know there was platinum right outside of this, right? I saw it. Yeah, right down here. Okay. Perfect. Okay. A nice big plutonium crystal right here that we'll grab. love these big guys. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Um, let's see here. I forget Thamium is like super strong. Here. There we go. Okay. Okay. All right. On to the ship. Yeah, I love this big guy. I have to name him something really fun. Once we get to the ship, we'll name him... Actually, I'll let you guys name him. As long as it's not crude. I'd like to have a good stash of, like, iron, platinum, like, all the resources when I leave. Carbon. Let me go ahead and get some carbon. Because the basic resources are really hard to find. Oh, come on. Basic resources are really uh, hard to find in space, right? So. I'm scanning, but I'm not getting anything on my Hey, get out of my way, slug bug. 
I'm not seeing, like... Uh, it's because I'm full, I bet. Alright. Okay. Nice. Okay, I'm full anyway. Platinum! Sweet. Okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Charge this up. Yeah, figure out what you want to call it, because it's definitely an atrocity. <laughs> it's really ugly. But he's cool, I like him. He was my buddy, he helped me find stuff. Nothing found. Alright, let's see here. Um goodies here that I don't want to leave behind. Let's discard. Okay. Power canister. Sweet. Okay. That was pass required. Oh, shoot. Um, right. I just discarded my iron, didn't I? Is this a cave? Please tell me this is a cave. Please tell me I can get a little thermal protection here. Okay, cool. I can I can chill here. Okay. All right. So I just need to destroy the iron. We're gonna get plenty of iron here. All right, okay. So let's transfer to that. That's full. Um. Alright, something's gotta go. Don't... don't scan me. Don't scan me. Please don't scan me. Okay. That was close. Alright, um... At copyright, that's the thing, like... That's cool. Full thing of iridium. The rest of this stuff is just so... Blah. Um, oh, that's fine. Okay. All right. All right, here we go. 30 seconds away. Wait a minute. I thought I discovered all you guys. One species left. I wonder if it's the bird species. No, I discovered them already. Okay. Okay. We're back. All right, so let's let's look at this. This is the one thing we haven't looked at yet. 
Reality seems to fold in on itself. One moment I can see debris and another a vast red orb, almost too large and too bright to behold. It knows me inside and out more than I could ever myself. Could this be the face of creation itself? Or in my hazy, freshly awakened state am I being manipulated? A name burns itself into my mind and a request made without words that I should follow this, the path this being, this atlas has set for me. I think that Gemma would definitely be interested in this. I feel suffused with the warm glow of approval I was lost, but now I've found the Atlas acknowledges my allegiance, and I feel certain that it will manifest itself again soon. Alright. We have officially fixed the starship. <laughs> so what are we missing, then? We've got... So let's, let me upload all the things that aren't... Uh... No reason in naming the plants. I'm not going to bother with that. But I will let you guys name the animals. <laughs> this thing, though. This thing is the best. I love it. I know what to call this guy. If you guys don't, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to name him. I'm going to name him... Bubba... Saurus Rex. All right. Name them. Okay. So this is going to be the uh, Stego Cat. Stego Cat. Sure. And this will be... Bubasaurus 2. Ah. Bubasaurus <laughs> 2. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> this is... This thing was so annoying. It constantly was trying to kill me. So, this is like... Uh, Abacus... Crabicus. Let's just call it Crabicus. That's fine. Next. <laughs> this thing. Um. Fred. Fredalo? It's the Fredalo. And this is the Sluggalo. And this will be the fly elope. Alright, we got it. We got it. And the planet... We'll name the planet Venado. Cool. Alright. And we'll name the system later. We're just gonna we're gonna get out of here. I don't think my character wants to spend another moment on this planet. Space we go.